This is the new day where Bahamians' rights are violated. Leader of the Coalition of Independents, Lincoln Bain, with a microphone in hand. Some 100 supporters on deck and a Bahamian flag as his backdrop on Tuesday morning further alleged that undocumented migrants have created a shantytown on Paradise Island and, he says, reliable sources told him so. I spoke to Bahamians in that area, white and black, who talked about the problems that they are having because of these immigrants. But let's pump the brakes there because the immigration minister, Keith Bell, after catching wind of the brewing saga, which has gone viral on social media, sought to directly address Bain's assertions. It is absolutely rubbish, nonsense, that a shanty town exists on Paradise Island. It is a complete lie. Now, Bain says according to his investigations, Haitians living there are illegal and undocumented. Well, that's not what the legal authority on immigration said today. Those persons there are here documented. The individuals were born in the Bahamas and they have made application. And the buck stops there, says Bell. He admitted concern about instances like these where public outrage is sparked based on unfounded information. I think it's really disingenuous of Mr. Bain and his cohorts to indicate that nothing much is being done and to represent um, matters that I have discovered are in fact not the case. So we asked Bain today if he intends to go knocking on every door in every community that he thinks is a shanty town to ask its residents if they have legal paperwork to be in country. That is the government's job. Bell Bell says then let government do its job. I think that when we as Bahamians when we do not have hidden agendas, and I will reveal some more things in time to come, which is really unfortunate, you will see exactly what I'm speaking of. If it is that we're saying that the Bahamas is for Bahamians and we want to keep it that way, then let us all act with one voice and be sincere in our actions to ensure that persons who are here illegally, that they are caught, they are prosecuted, and they are deported. The O'Seeley Eyewitness News.